7 Exercises to Ease Sciatic Nerve Pain If you're new here, welcome to the strongest family on YouTube. We're glad that you're here. Most times, we consistently deal with lower back pain. Something as common as sleeping in the wrong position can leave you sore for the following day. However, sciatic pain is quite different. It begins in the lower back but doesn't stay there. The pain can easily move to your buttocks, down to one or both of your legs, and most times to your toes. Instead of feeling soreness or an aching back, you will begin to feel an intense pain that overtakes the entire backside of your body and legs. This may make you think something's very wrong and that severe treatment is needed. But your healing actually begins at home, and all you may ever need are few back stretches and core exercises to deal with sciatic nerve pain. In today's video, we will show you the best exercises that can help you ease the pain. Starting from your nerve glides, glute bridges to butterfly stretch, and many more. Watch to the very end to know more about all of them. Before we continue, please take some seconds to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button, then tapping the bell icon so that you will be the first person to know when we post new videos. Here are the exercises to ease sciatic nerve pain. 1. Knee to Chest Stretch This exercise can help remove the inflammation and pain linked with the sciatic nerve. Lay your back on the ground or an exercise mat. Put a book or a cushion under your head. Proceed by bending your knees and placing the sole of your feet flat on the ground. Keep your torso relaxed. Bend one of your knees towards your torso and pull it towards you with your hands. Try not to pull too far. If you begin to feel uncomfortable, Back off a little bit. Hold the stretch for about 20 to 30 seconds, then repeat the same routine on the other leg. Repeat on both legs up to three times. 2. Nerve Glides. This type of exercise will help in improving your flexibility, but be careful of stretching the nerve. The more symptom-free movement you have on your legs, the better. Start by lying on your back with your left foot on the floor and your right knee pulling in towards your chest while you flex your right foot. Next, extend your leg, point your toes, and strengthen your leg as high as you can without actually causing a pulling sensation. Repeat this process at least 10 times. Try to avoid the classic hamstring stretch with your toes pulled towards you, as this will pull aggressively on the sciatic nerve. 3. The Dead Bug One of the most important ways to relieve yourself from sciatica is by increasing your core stabilization. The dead bug is a great exercise that helps in increasing your core strength and stability. Lay flat on your back with your arms extended towards the ceiling. Then raise your leg and bend your knees at 90 degrees, so your lower legs are parallel with the floor. Engage your core and draw your belly button in to get your back flat against the floor. Gradually lower your right arm behind your head and extend your left leg forward at the same time, exhaling as you go on. Keep doing that until your arms and legs are above the floor, be careful not to raise your back off the floor. Then, when you inhale, gradually return to the starting position and repeat with your other limbs. You should target three sets of 5 to 10 reps on each side or keep going until the shaking in your abs becomes too much. 4. Lower Back Twist. This exercise really digs deep into your gluteus muscle group. Begin by lying on your back while keeping your knees and feet flat against the floor. Extend your arms out to the side in a T position. Be sure to keep your shoulders against the floor as you move through this stretch and toughen your core to support the upper spine and shoulder. Laying on the floor, slowly rock your knees side to side, beginning to warm the muscle. Then drop the knees to the side. If they can touch the floor, that will be fine, but be sure to do so without lifting the opposite shoulder from the floor. If you require a bolster, that is fine. Hold for about 20 to 30 seconds before you switch to the other side. 5. Butterfly Stretch This simple stretch will stretch your inner groins and inner thigh. It is awesome for relieving sciatic pain. Get into a seated position. While on it, bend your knees and bring the soles of your feet together. Rest your elbows on your knee while holding your feet with your arms. Allow your knees to fall toward the floor while you keep your back straight. You can apply gentle pressure on your inner thigh by pressing gently on the knees with the elbows. You will feel a gentle pull and tension in your groin. Hold that stretch for about 20 to 30 seconds. Release and repeat at least three times. 6. The Seated Twist. 
Sit on the ground with your legs extended in front of you. Put your feet on the floor while you bend your knees. Then slide your left foot underneath your right leg to the outside of your right hip, bend at the knee, and lay the outside of your left leg on the floor. If you begin to feel uncomfortable, keep your left leg extended in front of you. When you do this, bring your right foot over the left leg and place it on the ground just outside of your left hip. Your knee should be pointing directly up at the ceiling. Place your right hand on the ground behind you. Twist your torso toward the inside of your right thigh and put your left upper arm on the outside of your right thigh, close to your knee. Hold this final position for 30 seconds, and then repeat on the other side. 7. Glute Bridges. The glute is considered a group of muscles in the buttocks. If they are tights, they can press on the sciatic nerve. Lay your back on the floor with a bended knee. Your feet should be about shoulder width apart. Relax your arms at your sides. Push through the heels. Raise your hips until your body forms a straight line from your knees to your shoulders. Hold that position for a few seconds. Gradually lower the hips to the ground, then repeat. Glute bridges, coupled with many other exercises, are awesome ways to burn away body cellulite. Have you tried any of these exercises before? Did they help with sciatic pain? Let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and tap the bell icon for more videos like this.